Good morning, this is Lisa with Mama Lisa's Bakery. And there's Teddy. Stole my sack. <laughs> um, yesterday, me and Teddy took like a five-mile hike. And uh, we went to um, Woodstock, Virginia, Seven Bends. And it was a beautiful park. Um, and, of course, I always go off the beaten trail because that's where you find the coolest stuff. And yesterday I found some, of course, unedible mushrooms, but at least I didn't pick a million of them. And uh, we found some pawpaws. Most of you probably haven't heard of pawpaws. It was only uh, about five years ago I found out about pawpaws from my son. He's a naturalist, too. So I found some pawpaws, and they're little fruits about this big. And they have these big, gigantic um, seeds in them that look like large coffee beans. So I came home yesterday, and I got a big, like, quart of pawpaws. And they're a type of fruit that is, like, um, tastes similar to a banana, mango, and a pineapple. It's really good. And they're not grown commercially because they don't um, ship well. And they are delicious. I was so excited to find them. <laughs> so I came home and I cleaned them all up yesterday. And today I wanted to read up a little bit about pawpaws. And I found out that the seeds of the pawpaws are like excellent health benefits. So I went through my trash can and pulled out all my pawpaw seeds. <laughs> so um, I wrote it down. There are so many benefits to the pawpaw seeds and the pawpaw. Um, number one, it's a powerful anti-cancer drug. I don't like to use drug. I would say cure. cure. Um, it um, promotes, promotes kidney health and it helps with type 2 diabetes. It fights infections. It promotes kidney health. Um, it's high in anti-inflammatory of the stomach and the colon. It's great in fiber. It decreases the risk of heart disease, stroke, diabetes, and obesity. And it grows in the wild. I found a whole forest of them. I couldn't believe it. I could only fit so many in my backpack. So I have the seeds and I have the pawpaws. It's good in ice cream, but I think I'm going to make it into like a... Uh, bread, like a pawpaw bread. So I'm going to make some muffins if you're interested in them. And like, um, back in like 2015, they sold for like, um, the pawpaw pop for about five dollars a pound. I have a cup, I have a few pounds. I'm probably going to be going back to get more. They're so sweet and delicious. They're so something like you've never had before. So, um, they're also, um, high in vitamin C, 22% of your daily, magnesium, 32, iron, 54, and magnesium, uh, 124. So I thought I'd tell you about that. Teddy had such a good time. <laughs> He's so cute. He had such a good time. Oh, and also I stopped at the Seventh-day Adventist, um, church in Newmarket, and I got some apples that were just picked yesterday. So if you want to place an order for your apple pie, I'm going to be making them apple pie, Dutch apple, French apple, which is like a Dutch apple pie with raisins in it. And here are my beautiful, ah, one of them fell, uh, let's see, apples here. So I have lots and lots, I have two packs of apples. So, um, I'm going to be making some apple caramel uh, muffins. They're really good, too. I can also make it into a cake if you like. It's delicious. It's like a Jewish apple cake with a nice, um, thick caramel icing, and I put um, walnuts and pecans on the top. Very good. So, I thought I'd tell you about that. And um, making some rolls today, I might have... An extra dozen if you're interested. And I am, what else? Oh, I'm also making some chocolate chip cookies. I'll have, I think, about a dozen left over after uh, my orders. 
So that's what I'm working on today. So I thought I'd tell you about the pawpaws and my apples. So I want you all to have a great day. God loves you, each and every one of you. And be the reason somebody smiles today.